What do you notice about this code behind me? Do you notice there's a Git conflict? The best way to not be scared of Git conflicts is let's create a few and let's resolve them. Git conflict is these less than symbols and then head, which is where you are in your branch. And then underneath that are your changes. Then it's broken with the equal symbols. And now it will show us the incoming changes. And then this line here are the changes that are coming in and it will say which branch it's coming in from. This lab is from the official GitHub team, which means it's been really thought out and they've really thought about how to make it easier for you to follow along and to test your skills and push your skills a bit further. So here are the steps we're gonna go through in this video. We're gonna resolve a conflict, merge our first resolve pull request, and resolve conflicts in a more complex pull request. And we're gonna merge the pull request and we're actually gonna create a conflict. And then we're gonna resolve the conflict that we created. And then we'll merge the final pull request. And so by the end of this video, you should no longer be scared of Git conflicts.